Hello everybody, and welcome to another Let's Play of mine. This time I decided to get away from the FPSs a little bit, and go into more I Spy kind of stuff. So this time around we're going to play a game I found that I had a stash away for some time. Uh, on this CD. Treasure Masters and Treasure Masters Incorporated. So yeah. Let's create a new profile. Let's do it under my I don't know what? To my YouTube name. Alright. Settings. I need to change the strike quickly. You make sure it records with the microphone because as, as you know I am recording right now I'm recording on a Windows XP 12 year old PC perfect architecture for all this but Windows XP does not like it where you have recording doesn't let fraps record sound and microphone at the same time so everything is recorded through the microphone so yeah Let's see if this works. All right, let's play. Play relaxed mode, time limit mode. You know what? I would do relaxed mode. I don't. Time limit modes kind of frustrate me. Persia, prologue, tutorial. Complete the tutorial to learn the basics of the game. Find all the items for us to play. Alright. Click on the lens icon for more for help finding a item. Right, let's see that right there, I guess. Find all the items hidden in this scene. Look closely, all the as they might be well concealed. To complete the level, collect all the items at the location shown on the map. Yes, I want to show tips. You can also find coins hidden in various locations, collect and purchase additional tips. Okay. So what do I need? I played this game I played this game before, but it's been a couple years. Ah, okay. So yeah, when you see the cursor that looks like it's a grabbing hand, you can perform certain actions on that object such as activate, rotate, blah blah blah. The moon. Starts out pretty easy. Bird. There's a coin. Yeah, I don't want to buy an additional tip. Bird. What do I need? A chess piece. Now they might be blown out of proportion, or they might be. Uh, okay, looks like I'm not even. Okay, yeah. So that's right here. And I need the key to open that door. I guess this meter shows when I gone uh, how many bad tries I have. And see, of it looks like I can take a closer up look. So I mean, I can look inside the fridge. Yeah, a turkey is a bird. In case I've noticed. Or um, a balloon. Why would you have a balloon in the fridge? I don't know. This is a nice wagon. Or it's a treasure, uh, hidden mystery game, or whatever you know. Oh, pe that's a pecan? Hmm. I don't think I'll find a baseball. Oh, I found a baseball? How about that? Or just piece? I don't think I found a chess piece in here. And I found a coin. What else? Alright, so there's either a bird or a chess piece in here. Oh, chess piece. Blind as a bat. Is there anything else in here? A bird. So I need to find those parts of those things. Okay, so I'm back in the fridge.
Alright, oh, that was a mousetrap? Okay, so now I need to find a microphone. That's a shaver. So everything's in this general area or the fridge. Okay. It's a microphone we're looking for. Let's see if I can find it. I want to use the least amount of hints as possible. Not that it does anything. Yeah, you know. Okay, so it's in the fridge again. And you know what? I'm gonna f be looking right at it and be like, oh. Oh, there was a coin? Three more coins to find. There's coin. Oh! You know what? I'm gonna find all the coins then. Ah, because I can use them to buy hints, and trust me, later on, hints will be very useful. Alright, so I need keys. So it doesn't take a hint to sh doesn't use a hint to oh, where's the microphone there? Wait a minute, that wasn't there before. That would be kidding me. Found an item you can use, that's why it was placed in your inventory. You can carry your inventory from one location to another, click the right mount button to, alright, to take an arm on it. And for the entry, I use another object. Great, you can use logic to buy on items. Remember, items found at one location may be needed in another. Good luck. Chapter completed. Oh, plane struck. World today, mysterious disappearing former archaeologist and treasure hunter Jack Jones has disappeared. Chapter 1 Last Will and Testament The plane of the famous treasure hunter Jack Jones has disappeared over the Pacific Ocean. According to the According to his will, his grandson has become the sole owner of the I guess the company. Hello, my name is Jordan Gones. I'd like to come in. I called you about your grandfather's disappearance. His plane vanished in a storm over the Pacific Ocean. Okay, so I have three options. Have they found him? What was he flying over the storm? Was he alone in the plane? I say have they found him. No, unfortunately, the rescue operation lasted a week and they didn't find Jack. Jack meaning. Hey, that means he can still be alive, right? Well, it 